I took 32 random South Park Funko Pops and I put them into a bracket for the people on my Discord server to vote for the best South Park Funko Pop. And let's just say things got pretty interesting. I do votes like this all the time on my Discord server, everything Funko. I take a specific line of Funko Pops and I put them into a bracket and let people decide on what is the best pop of that line. So if you want to participate in the next Funko Pop vote, make sure you join my Discord server. There will be a link in the description of this video. But yeah, I took 32 random South Park Park Funko Pops. There's a lot of South Park Funko Pops, a lot of really good ones. So just like all the previous votes that I've done, all of the pops were picked out at random. 32 different South Park Funko Pops. Let's go take a look at what they are. First off, we've got Ranger Stan, Unmasked Osimo, Kyle, Mr. Mackey, Kenny, Mintberry Crunch, Towley, Randy Marsh, Chef, Wonder Tweak, Cartman, Grand Wizard Cartman, Osimo, Zombie Kenny, Mr. Hanky, Butters, Kyle, Terrence, Philip, Goth Stan, Mr. Garrison, Chef, Priest Cartman, Paladin Butters, High Elf King Kyle, Boy Band Cartman, Timmy, Boy Band Kyle, Digital Stan, Ike, and Professor Chaos. These South Park Funko Pops have got to be some of the best Funko Pops in my opinion that Funko has made. And I know a lot of you guys can agree with me on that. They're always super cool, always unique, always full of detail. I like them a lot. I've got some of them as you can see behind me. So this video is definitely going to be tough. There's going to be a lot of awesome battles. And I totally encourage you guys to play along with the video choose which pop is better out of the two as we go on and feel free to let me know in the comments down below if there's anything that you disagree with or even agree with in the video with all that being said let's get into round one of the vote first off we've got ranger stan versus osimo but there is a very clear better pop here osimo is a lot better in my opinion and you guys seem to agree with me on that on the discord server because osimo won with 76 votes against nine then it's kyle versus mackey and mr mackey lost with 38 votes to 46 okay then we had kenny against mintberry Crunch and Mintberry Crunch lost with 30 votes against 53. And someone seemed to have reacted to this post with a photo of me with a Naruto headband on mewing. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't even know that was a thing on the Discord server. Who made this? And then next up, we got Tao Lee versus Randy Marsh, and Randy Marsh lost by a lot. He lost with 12 votes against 70. Then we have Chef and Tuxedo versus Wonder Tweak, and Wonder Tweak lost with 25 votes against 54. Chef is a fan favorite, so that does make sense, I guess. But Wonder Tweak is it's Tweak. It's the only pop of Tweak we have, and that's a really cool pop. Then we have Cartman with the glasses on versus Grand Wizard Cartman and Grand Wizard Cartman won with 55 votes against 29. Osimo versus Zombie Kenny and Zombie Kenny lost with 28 votes against 61. Now I might be biased because I do own Zombie Kenny in my collection but Zombie Kenny is a lot better than Osimo. I don't know man I don't know maybe that's just me. Then we got Mr. Hanky versus Butters and Butters lost with 26 votes against 57. Butters is cool but he's going up against Mr. Hanky which is arguably one of the best South Park Funko Pops just because of how weird and cool it is. Like, if you told me when I first started collecting that Funko was going to make a poop as a Funko Pop, I wouldn't believe you. Then we got Kyle versus Terrence, and Terrence won with 50 votes against 37. Philip versus Goth Stan, and Goth Stan won with 59 votes against 26. Mr. Garrison versus Chef, and Chef won with 64 votes against 21. Preacher Cartman versus Randy Marsh, and Randy Marsh lost with 15 votes to 67. And yeah, I said Randy Marsh again, because I made a mistake. I put Randy Marsh in it twice, but it's okay. He got eliminated both times. No one really cares about him. But if I'm going to be honest, I didn't even notice I put Randy Marsh in this twice up until now. I went through like a whole week of posting these updates to the discord server and only now I'm realizing Randy Marsh is in it twice. That's pretty crazy. I'm gonna be honest, but he lost both times, so it doesn't even matter. Then we got Paladin Butters versus High Elf King Kyle, and Kyle won with 74 votes against 10. Boy Band Cartman versus Timmy and Gobbles, and Timmy, of course, won with 70 votes against 14. Timmy's great. He's a really new pop, and I can definitely see why people like him. It's really cool. Gobbles is a great touch. Then we got Boy Band Kyle versus Digital Stan, and Digital Stan won with 66 votes against 17. And finally, Ike against Professor Chaos, and Professor Chaos won with 63 votes against 28. And I think that one is the biggest upset in today's video because why would Ike lose first round? How could he lose first round? Ike is one of the best pops. That's one of the best South Park Fungal Pops. It's so cool. It's great. It's an awesome pop. How did Ike lose first round to Professor Chaos? But what do you guys think of this first round? Let me know in the comments. 16 pops are eliminated and 16 pops move on. Let's move on to round two. Kicking off round two, we had Unmasked Osimo versus Kyle and this one is, it's, I feel bad for Kyle. Kyle lost with four votes against 90. That has to be the biggest disparity in votes ever recorded in one of these pop votes. That is just insane. I low-key feel bad for Kyle. Then we had Kenny versus Towley, and Towley won with 73 votes against 18. Chef and Tuxedo versus Grand Wizard Cartman. Grand Wizard Cartman won with 77 votes against 15. 
Awesome O versus Mr. Hanky. Mr. Hanky won with 53 votes to 38. That one's very valid. Awesome O is a cool pop, but Mr. Hanky, it's it's Mr. Hanky. Then we got Terrence versus Goth Stan, and Goth Stan lost with 25 votes to 63. Chef against Preacher Carmen, and Carmen lost with 12 votes to 76. High Elf King Kyle versus Timmy, and Timmy won with 81 votes to 9. And finally, Digital Stan versus Professor Chaos. Professor Chaos won with 78 votes to 18. A lot of really cool pops in that round, a lot of really tough decisions but I want to know your thoughts on that round in the comments below. With all that being said, let's move on to round three. Eight pops are eliminated and eight pops move on. Round three kicks off with an awesome battle between Unmasked Awesomeo and Tao Li. Two really cool pops, but you guys in the Discord server seem to have a very clear favorite, and that is Awesomeo with 75 votes to 39. Then we had Grand Wizard Cartman versus Mr. Hanky, and Mr. Hanky lost with 36 votes to 79. I'm surprised it wasn't even close. Mr. Hanky's a really cool pop, but you guys seem to have a favorite out of the two. I, I think it should have been a little bit closer though. 79 to 36, that's just rude. Then we got Terrence versus Chef, and this one's also very like insane as well too, that it wasn't closer. Chef won with 91 votes against 27. And then finally, we had Timmy versus Professor Chaos. Timmy won, of course, with 88 votes against 30. This round was pretty crazy because none of the votes were even close. All the votes were pretty far apart. That means we have four Funko Pops left that you guys seem to like a lot. So this next round is going to be really hard. So let's move on to round four. Four Pops are eliminated and four pops move on. Kicking off this round, we had Grand Wizard Cartman versus Unmasked Awesomeo. Two really awesome Cartman Funko Pops, but in the end, Awesomeo won with 78 votes to 29. And then we have probably the hardest battle out of today's video. We have Timmy against Chef. Two fan favorites, two really cool pops. But in the end, there was a clear favorite here. Timmy won with 75 votes to 23. Can we get some Fs in the comments for Chef? This pop is just so cool. Chef's awesome. Why is he out? What do you guys think so far in the vote? Is there some pops that got eliminated early that you think should have made it further. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. But with all that being said, let's move on to the final round. Two pops remain. We got Timmy and Gobbles versus Awesomeo Unmasked. Who's gonna win here? I don't know, honestly. Two really cool pops. On one hand, you have Timmy and Gobbles, which is a clear fan favorite. Everyone loves Timmy in the show, and the pop is awesome as well. And then on the flip side, you've got Unmasked Awesomeo, which has a really cool mold, really cool design, and it's a really awesome character. So if it was up to me, I would have a hard time choosing here but in the end I would probably have to go with Timmy and Gobbles and it seems like you guys agreed with me on the discord server because the votes were in favor of Timmy and Gobbles with 69 votes to 43 making this Timmy and Gobbles Funko Pop the best South Park Funko Pop according to you guys on my discord server let me know your thoughts on everything that happened in the votes in the comments like I said at the start of the video if you want to participate in one of the upcoming Funko Pop votes and you want to vote for the better pop of whatever line I'm doing next make sure you join my discord server there will be a link in the description of this video but yeah thank you guys so much for watching today's video I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.